the next point is that organizing helps in the development of personnel now clearly defined work and well defined teams allow effective monitoring by managers so managers can easily see how well the employees are performing in their assigned activities uh, who are the good performers who are the great performers and who needs to improve managers can ensure that uh, the workload is distributed equitably among all staff so that none of the staff get overloaded and people actually have time and the opportunity to learn new skills and uh, the job rotation and uh, special projects also allow staff to learn new skills and to display their talent for example a person from my risk management team consistently showed a knack for software programming because he used to write macros to automate our work so we eventually gave him an opportunity to move into the team and do the kind of work where he had a natural talent and interest so efficient organizing of work allows employees to explore various opportunities for personal growth and development